CBS 4 News health alert and flu concerns are mounting all over our area. And the CDC says the season is not likely to peak until sometime next month. This as a family in West Palm Beach says that their son, Dylan Winnick, died from complications from the flu. The 12 year old had not gotten a flu shot. His would be at least the third flu related death in Florida in the past few weeks. CBS 4's Ted Scouten reports from outside Memorial Regional Hospital in Wynwood with what we need to know. I don't want anyone else to feel like this. It's uh, it's terrible. It just wipes you out and you're, you're pretty much helpless. Clifton Snyder feels like he was practically on death's doorstep a couple days ago, suffering from a bad case of the flu. Maybe like 40 hours I was curled up in a fetal position in my bed. I couldn't move. I couldn't get out of bed. Uh, and then the muscle soreness felt like I got run over. And he's not alone. I need you to go in and do a flu swab, okay? At the Memorial Urgent Care Center in West Pines, they're seeing a lot of flu cases. Look at all the orange on that map. That shows the counties where we're seeing increases. In all, 452 cases are confirmed statewide, but that number is deceiving since counties are not required to submit those numbers. We're seeing an extraordinary number of flu cases this year. Dr. Mark Shapiro is treating a lot of patients lately, many complaining of common flu symptoms like a rapid onset, fever, muscle aches, sometimes congestion or cough, and headache. It's very much more severe, and I think the average patient knows when they have a cold, and they know that this feels different. The key is getting to the doctor within 48 hours of the first symptoms so you can get medication like Tamiflu. But the Tamiflu itself should shorten the duration if the average person was going to have this viral syndrome, meaning all those things that we said. For seven to 10 days, we can hope to shorten it to three to five days. To avoid getting the flu in the first place, the Florida Department of Health recommends getting vaccinated, frequent hand cleaning, avoid close contact with anyone who's sick, disinfect surfaces, and avoid touching your face. Clifton hopes he'll feel better by this weekend. I feel like I'm coming out of the woods now and I just want to get back amongst the living. So the big takeaway from all this, if you think you have the flu, get to the doctor right away. Hopefully you can be treated and shorten the duration. In Pembroke Pines, Ted Scouten, CBS 4 News.